what's most important in practice, practicing medicine is to do no harm and to do what's best for your patient. By employing the PAL system, what we have found here um, in our practice is that we're able to have less recovery time. The patient can come in on a Thursday or Friday, they're back to work on Monday, and that's really what their clients are looking for. And as far as overall, you know, bruising and swelling and stuff, we find with the PAL system that we don't have as much as we used to with the, with the old standard liposuction techniques. With the PAL system, we find that the general reciprocating motion that goes back and forth into the tissue really allows us to direct the cannula exactly where we want it, thereby giving a better body sculpting procedure to the patient. Um, some of the older system or other systems out there actually have a rotating motion which actually does a lot more tissue damage as it goes in, but PALS is pretty, pretty simple, pretty quick, pretty easy, it reciprocates back and forth. With some of the older systems, we actually had to really use that upper body strength to, get, to go back and forth to get in the desired planes that we needed. But with the PALS system, we're able, we're able to just go right in, it does the work for us, and we, do, we just basically direct our motion to where we want it. Micro air is one of the newer technologies that we use um, that doesn't have any kind of thermal effect on the tissue, such as in the ultrasonic uh, systems out there like VASER. With the PAL system, what we find is there is thermal modulation, but it's really from a frictional um, standpoint, so we're able to control it, and thereby you really take the um, option of hurting your patient by, by thermal injury off the table.